first mine looks like it's going to be terrible. Possibly. I just see lots of dirt, but I also see a minecart track. Go check it out. See where I should be putting my skill points. Let's do it with none of these to start. There is a tomb. It's also a vault. Entrance one. There's only one entrance. If I get rid of this dirt, dirt is pretty tanky. When do diggers come? Diggers come pretty early. If I don't kill the diggers, the minecart still will. One more digger. So ideally, I would want them to come through here. Through here, through here. The problem is I can't actually wall like that. Okay, so maybe I don't want them coming through here. If I break this open, these units are just stuck. Huh. Can I hit that with fire? No. Hey, but I can hit it with that. This won't work on this, right? Did that just work on it? No, because it would be doing Interesting map for sure. This is a super good place for harpoons. I think I would build multiple harpoons instead of one super one. Really good spot for demons right here. The only way that I could do that is if I build a barricade there and upgrade it a bunch. Good, place this here. Give it the alchemy so they know what I should have done. Never mind. Spell that. It needs regen. Now it could have alchemy. I don't know how many kills it would actually get here. Hey, the tomb's about to break open. That could be a problem. It's a whole bunch of diggers. I'm gonna say they're trapped though. Kind of trapped. This will blow up the dirt, but it also hits a whole bunch of units. Oh, I was supposed to open this within three minutes. I still could. Wasn't really trying to win like this. We can easily open that. Those diggers are going to stand on the train tracks and get killed by minecarts. Hey, we opened the vault. New consumable trap. Why are you coming down? Because you're a digger. First totem. First. the gold.
Will they be attracted to this one? I'm not sure. That's pretty close to the road. Nope. Okay, but the minecart blowing up did weird things to it. Still earning the gold. I didn't even realize there's a second entrance right here. Whatever. Doesn't matter. if it's worth it to buy barricades. I don't think it is, but... See? This wasn't even supposed to be a run. It was me testing things. weird that this one doesn't have its thing. They will attack these if they spawn right here. Maybe not kickers. But this spot I could probably fill up a bit. Do notice a bunch of these leaking by. Still not copying and pasting. Okay, copy and paste. What happened here? They blew up my barricade. Those jerks. It did have gold on it, so it was a target. Could build it again without the gold. I think that makes sense. With the regen. Either that, or else you build it as a trap that they do target it. I wanted a spot for these. Barricade has been destroyed. Those jerks. Could not afford the upgrade for this? generating good gold. We're near the end. I opened a vault. I opened the other thing. Oh, I should at least have one of these, though. Uh, 
maybe not. Having multiple harpoons here would probably be good. Range does go across, which is nice. This is the final wave. But we're going endless afterwards. Even though my skill points are not in the right place, I still get my three gems, which is good. Got the curse totem. This oil looks interesting, but not it's just a normal tier or whatever. It's not even uncommon. Knocking a, or the minecart, knocking out a bunch of these. So I would control right click. Seventeen thirty seven. Getting pretty expensive. that good. Those are going to take a little while to pay for themselves, but if I last even a little while, I should do it. I just need them each to earn like 2,000. That should be cool. Old traps, I would be using those a bit. But I don't. Instantly. There we go. Blew that up at least. Still have forty lives. That's not what I meant to put there. My bad. Apparently I did not copy and paste that correctly. Okay, that's better. one is meant to tempt them. So they should stand on this for a little bit. Spent way more gold than I should have.
this ram might just blow up this barricade without even meaning to. Could have spring traps here. It might spring things back across. I don't think that's the worst though. And my gold one just got blown up. resistant to physical forces, but if they were affected by that, they would change colors. Why didn't I just put some points into fire? Next time, putting some points into fire. And maybe into slowing with the chill. Barricade has taken some damage. Probably from exploding minecarts. But it heals pretty quick. Okay, they're coming through here, so they did destroy a bunch of my stuff. self-repair max HP max HP if I survive this part I'll be glad that I rebuilt those if I don't survive that was a waste of money you can pull it That's the only one of that, so it's going pretty quickly. Got a limit increase, but if I build more than one of those high tier ones, they slow down quickly they'll do stuff which I don't care much for these you can build demons slowly for all the others I like them firing pretty quickly it lose a life there but it looks like I'm getting things back under control I can get one fast shooting hex trap. That's probably worth it. Too bad I can't get upgrades to it, but still worth it. What did I just do? I just spent 10,000 to increase physical force. 10%. Okay. I think I only have to get to 15,000 to get my 50%. Maybe it was 20,000, but I think it was 15. But we can do that. Generating lots of gold. But the enemies are getting pretty tough. I did prefer it when these ones went up. 
That's a good spot for a bomb. I'll have to leave some more. Probably sell traps to get to the 15,000. Almost definitely. How much do you sell for? Not much. Oh, but these sell for a ton. Some of these overboard. Speed things up. Under attack. This one got attacked a little bit. I could have harpoons here. I could have that push trap right here. Probably better than right here. Spring trap here. Even without selling things, I'm getting to my 20,000, it looks like. How many of you killed? Zero kills. Yeah, I think 20,000 maxes out my gold bonus. More than maxes it out. Endless outcome. Eh, we'll take it. Item quantity. Starting gold. Between these two, I don't value the gems. I don't even spend my gems. I should be. They're good. They are good. Give me the starting wealth. Here, I will take consumables. I am still not even close to seeing all the maps. Here, six. Clear the map. Clear the map within six minutes. Survive a wave with six wrath level. Start with eight free barricades. Ooh, I like eight free barricades. That one looks interesting. It looks like there are lots of spots for bison. There are three starting points. And there's a, not a vault, so a tomb. Huh. Spider looks promising. This one looks like a pain. Might not be that bad. Only a tier four. Still haven't beaten square yet. That one's a tier five. I beat this, but I didn't rush all the waves. Oh. So I now see strategies with this where I could be using the guardians to really do some damage there. 159. Alright, let's not forget this. 
probably put even more points into this. I think the fire is that good. 23 points good? Yeah. Yep. Or I put some into the hex trap. Or the axe. The axe is also very good. That feels good. One skill point. Increases damage is pretty nice. This one's also very good. What is this one? Rune experience multiplayer bonus. Haven't been playing with the runes right now. I will put them back on Unish. Cutting Edge. How does Cutting Edge compare? Compares very favorably. Yeah, I think we go with Cutting Edge. All right, and yeah, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching.